We're here today to showcase the beginning of a company, which is called Wild Bike Technologies, a company that started up because there's a need out there for people to be able to monitor animals, wild animals, and domestic animals, and even people to monitor people. Well, wild Bites is a company that has needed the technology that we've produced within the university. Um, but one of the major problems is if you're going to put tech, high tech on animals, uh, animals have a complete disregard for the cost and sensitivity of high tech and so we needed housing for this and of course housing is not a trivial matter so we've been using expertise from CCAMS to help design housing and expertise from Astute to actually print these housing to kickstart the company. CCAMS uh, which is a project I'm managing is has been assisting a company World Bike Technologies Limited for the last year and we have been assisting them with engineering design of new products which have enabled them to bring their ideas and their research into concept and then into product development and production. For the past six months we've had these devices here which um, with Astute's help and Seacam's help we've actually got housings um, with an in integrated battery so we can actually put these on the back of animals. They were lacking the technology and the ability to create housing for their electronic components to uh, a robust housing that would withstand pressure, water pressure or the um, pressure from um, a, an animal um, compacting housing and then they needed engineering design expertise to design the housing that would uh, then be attached to animals in their natural environment. We can see lots of things that you're not able to see naturally by watching animals. So one example in um, leatherback turtles, it's very rare to see them being attacked by a white shark because you just can't get them both in the same scene. But with the tag on, the animal behaves more naturally and the world is more natural in its response. A stewed has been set up by the Welsh Government to support the Welsh manufacturing industry, industry across a wide range of, of topics from design for manufacture all the way to uh, recycling and, and end-of-life issues. Uh, our specific contribution to the project was on 3D rapid prototyping and, and manufacture. In industry. Basically, in the old days, you get a big block and you cut away what you don't need. Uh, the college and the project has invested in a wide range of facilities where we can manufacture from plastic to uh, metal parts and in this case we used our 3D plastic printing uh, devices which allowed us uh, working with the designers from Seacoms uh, to create a, a prototype fairly quickly. Yeah. So I have here the um, initial prototype that was developed for Wildbike Technologies and it is the uh, the, the design component of a tag that can be attached to an animal and here we are able to demonstrate that the electric components that are slotted within the housing here as well as the battery pack can then be neatly um, produced in housing that's designed specifically for an animal so in line with its environment uh, as well as the, the shape of the animal. Good morning Minister, ladies and gentlemen, very warm welcome to you on this very cold and wet day. Um, my name is Brett Siddell. I'm the um, project manager for Astute and I'll be your chair this morning. Uh, firstly, I'd like to introduce Professor Noel Thompson, who's the Pro Vice Chancellor from Swansea University, to give the formal welcome. Now, on behalf of the event organisers, uh, project teams, uh, and Swansea University, it gives me great pleasure uh, to welcome you here this morning to the Liberty Stadium uh, to hear about some of the, the really exciting. Uh, and groundbreaking work uh, being undertaken through a unique uh, Welsh European funding office, uh, multi-partner projects uh, based at Swansea University. Exciting, new and cutting edge project. Very, very proud to be here as your minister launching this today. And of course, this has been made possible uh, through a unique collaboration between the two innovative European-funded projects which Noel has spoken about already, Astute and CCAMS, and uh, delighted that I can take part in this launch. I think there are companies out there that 
sell tags for animals. I don't think any making tags as trendy as these, but um, one of the big problems is that they make tags that's just that are just standard tags. They're square or slightly rounded and so on. The nice thing about this is we can scan in, uh, this is the future, we can scan in the body of the animal. So it might be a fin on a, on a porpoise or it can be the neck on a badger or it can be the back of a bird. We can scan it in and we can make the tag so that it absolutely articulates perfectly with the animal and so the animal feels happier. That's the idea. Yes, to sum up, we're working on total world domination and it's proceeding really as planned. So thanks very much.